What's going on guys? Connor owns fast food here bringing you a new video. It is Taco Bell Double Dilla It's Taco Bell's new Double Dilla and this thing looks amazing man when this guy put this box in the bag I was like How is that? only four dollars holy crap i'm gonna show you guys this monster so since i'm a complete fat ass i was like okay the four dollar meal will not be enough but look at this box that's all in there oh my god four dollars for this and i was like okay i'll order some more stuff and my taco bell is also a kfc so if you're wondering why the bag is kfc it's because my taco bell is also a kfc hopefully this thing is huge i didn't actually see the thing yet look how big this box is my hand is huge this is huge hold on if this thing is if this thing is a monster it's understandably small it's actually kind of small they just tease me with this box look how big this box is to so get chips in this little bag and then you get some salsa which is actually pretty good because they didn't tell me that they're giving me salsa i'm trying to smell and make sure it's not really spicy salsa because i don't like spicy food this thing is called the double dilla i feel like some little kid made that name so we're gonna put the sauce here and we're gonna move the chips to the other side all right so i thought it was only this big but it's actually folded over so we're just gonna unfold it so this is the four dollar double dilla at taco bell well it's four dollars at my store it might differ in different stores but for four bucks i could already tell you that this is an amazing deal the guy was like oh yeah i stuffed it in there for you bullshit okay so we're gonna take a bite of the new double dilla I can already tell you guys, this is a 9 out of 10. This thing is amazing. It's got the perfect amount of spice. It's got vitamin G dripping off the steak. The sauce is on point. If you guys have a chance to go to Taco Bell and get the new Double Dilla, you could choose between steak or chicken. I obviously chose steak. If there's a choice of steak, why would you ever choose chicken? Look at that. Looks so delicious. Oh my god. So my dog is going to test the chips to see if they're good. Pound it. Good job. You want more? Haha! <laughs> I didn't even have to ask. So I'm gonna try to give him some of the bread because I know he really loves the bread. Make sure there's no sauce in there because the spicy food will be too much for my dog. You're supposed to face the camera when you're chewing, dude. He loves it too much. He doesn't want to leave. So what I really like about this steak is it's not like all like crunched up in like little pieces. It's actually like thick pieces of steak. Look at the vitamin G on all of that, man. Oh my God, it looks so greasy and delicious. Get a close up on that sexiness right there. Oh my God, it looks so delicious. Close that back up. Let's take a bite of that monster. Whenever I go to Taco Bell, I never usually get quesadillas. They're usually too much money and you don't get enough meat. But this Double Dilla is $4 and it is plenty. This thing is definitely worth $4. I could see it being $5 and I'd still buy it. But this Double Dilla, this Double Dilla is definitely a great improvement for Taco Bell. The Double Dilla is going to be added to my top five things at Taco Bell. This thing is so delicious. Hopefully this sauce isn't that spicy. It's so perfect. If you guys have a chance to go to Taco Bell, make sure you guys try Taco Bell's new Double Dilla. Get steak, not chicken. Fuck chicken. Now that I think about it, I think I should have asked for half chicken, half steak. That would have been pretty dope, actually. I'd rate this meal 9 quesadillas out of 10 quesadillas. Make sure you guys slap that thumbs up button. Comment down below what your favorite item is at Taco Bell. Become a subscriber and have a nice day. Peace out, guys. Bye-bye. Erectile dysfunction is bad, but leaving a like on the video isn't. Whether you're hard or soft, make sure to slap that like button and subscribe while you're at it.